Do your renders feel flat or boring? Even the most realistic and detailed scenes can fall short without a strong composition. But there's one simple technique that's often neglected, the rule of thirds. In this video, you'll learn how to apply it in D5 Render to instantly improve your visuals. Let's dive in. The rule of thirds divides your frame into nine equal sections using a three by three grid. When you align key elements along these lines or at their intersections, your scene feels more balanced and intentional. For example, see how this headphone is positioned right at the intersection? Your eyes are naturally drawn to it. Let's jump into D5 Render and apply the rule of thirds to an actual scene. First, open your camera settings and turn on the grid overlay. This will help you visualize where your focal points are. Composition isn't just about subject placement. It's about creating a sense of depth by adding layers. For instance, in this particular scene, we placed foreground elements to frame our subject. This helps add depth and guides our eyes through the scene. Here's a side-by-side -side comparison. The left render feels static and flat, but the right one, framed with the rule of thirds, flows naturally and feels more dynamic. Here's a bonus tip. Use lighting and camera angles to amplify the mood and story of your scene. Use a low angle shot to make your subject or space feel grand. Use wide angle shots to capture the full context and align your accent lights along the grids to draw attention to focal points. That's how you can instantly improve your renders with the rule of thirds. It's a simple technique that makes a huge difference. If you're ready to take your composition skills further, check out my book, Mastering Compositions for Architectural Visualization, A Beginner's Guide. It's packed with instructions and real-world examples to help you achieve cinematic results. It's available both in an ebook and paperback format. Grab yours now by using the link in the description. Remember, composition isn't just a technique, it's a way to tell your story. Thanks for watching. If you want to learn more about architectural visualizations, watch this next video right here.